Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of the Ryan Frage Create Universe. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button if you are new to the channel or if you are enjoying the series and want more. I would really appreciate it as it helps out the channel tremendously. Last week, Rage and Moxley were successful in their first tag team championship defense against the team of Sting and Darby Allen. After the match, they were blindsided by NJF and Wardlow, and I bet Rage is making his way to the ring right now to get answers from NJF. Last week MJF tried to blindside me once again. It doesn't look like he has noticed it yet, but I am now prepared for him to strike at any time and me and Marks always watch each other's backs. I can however not continue like this. My main goal in this company is the AEW Championship and if MJF continues this behavior, I will never accomplish that goal. MJF and I had two matches and we are currently on one win apiece. Let's ignore the fact that Wardlow assisted him in his victory over me. Let's call it like the record books does. MJF wants to prove he's better than me and I want him out of AEW. I think the answer is pretty clear. MJF, I want a match against you and not just any match. I want a false count anywhere match and if you lose this match, you're out of AEW. What a challenge just laid down by Wyatt Wage. What will MJF have to say about that? Why on earth would I agree to a match like that? I think I know the reason why you didn't propose that the loser of the match is out of AEW, but only that if I lose, I am out. Is that because you know I am better than you and you know you are going to fail? No, the reason actually is because I know exactly how smart you are. I know you would want to negotiate the terms of the match, so I had to leave myself some room to negotiate. I must say I am impressed. Your damn right if you had a stipulation like that, I want to add a stipulation of my own. But it's not what you think it is. If I win the match, I don't want you out of AEW. In fact, when I beat you, there's no place on earth I would rather want you to be than right here in All Elite Wrestling. You see, like everyone knows, the reason for our beef is you stealing the spotlight from me time after time. And with the stipulation I am about to add, I will make it damn near impossible for you to ever steal the spotlight from me ever again. The stipulation I want to add is that if you lose our match, you will never be allowed to compete for the AEW Championship ever again. Then when I win the AEW Championship, I will become the face of AEW and all you would be able to do is watch. Just like I had to do with you in the WWE. Well, I must say I did not expect that. Like I just told everyone, that AEW Championship is my destiny and if I can't compete for it, I'm not even sure what I'm doing in this company. But you know what Maxwell, you got yourself a deal on one condition. This match is a one on one match between you and me. If anyone interferes in this match, the stipulations added to it will fall away and be null and void. You already added two stipulations and now you want to add a third? You know what, it's fine, on one condition. You have to face Wardlow one on one right here tonight. You know what, you're actually doing me a favor. I still have a score to settle in for costing me that match against you. Just bring him out here. What a match just made official by Fine Page and MJF. The two of them will face off in a full scout anywhere match. With the stipulation that if Ryan Page loses the match, he will never be able to compete for the AEW Championship again. And if MJF loses the match, he's out of AEW. The stakes couldn't be higher. And ladies and gentlemen, that match will be taking place on the next episode, which will be the All Out pay-per-view. So don't miss it. But as for now, Brian Page, 
has to face the man who cost him the match against MJF. The first match between Rage and MJF, not the one of last week where Rage was victorious. It was the match that happened a week or two after MJF costed Rage the opportunity to become the inaugural AEW champion. Rage never had a one on one match with Warblow yet, who currently stands on four single wins and zero losses. The man is still undefeated in all elite wrestling will Brian Rage be the first man to defeat him yet tonight or will Wardlow extend his undefeated streak? Let's find out. Ah! <laughs> 
Walter with a brutal slam to one rage. Will that be enough to put the four-time WWE Champion away? And is, ladies and gentlemen, Wardlow extends his undefeated streak in AEW to five wins and zero losses, but remember Ryan Wage got what he asked for. No one will be able to interfere in his match with MJF next week or else the stipulations will become null and void. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in. Don't miss Ryan Wage vs MJF next week. The stakes couldn't be higher. I will see you all there. Thank you for tuning in.